I did not expect this at all from Mubiel. Like it honestly feels like there's nothing she can't do. Hello Claire Bears, it's Elsie. Welcome to my channel. If you are new and if you're returning, welcome back. Mubiel is back with her first comeback of what is my participation within Mumu. And it is a massive album at that with 12 different songs on it. But for the sake of this video, I am just going to be reacting to the two music videos for two songs from this album, which is think about and touching and moving. I've always been delighted and surprised by Moonbeal's individual songs and I feel like we're gonna have no shortage of surprises today for these two music videos. So let's get into it but before we do please don't forget to give this video a like if you enjoy it and subscribe to my channel. For today's beverage of the day, I will be enjoying a glass of Sauvignon Blanc. I feel like Moonbeal is a classy lady, so why not have a classy glass of wine to go along with my reaction? It's light and crisp and fruity, so perfect description of Moonbeal. <laughs> So we're gonna get started first with Think About, where the music video came out a few weeks ago, so I'm a little behind, but immediately I see that this is a vertical video. So is the whole music video gonna be like this? Now I'm so curious, I've never even thought about that, <laughs> of the percentage of people who would be watching on their phones versus like a computer. Where are you watching from? A phone, a laptop, a tablet, something else? I don't even know how else on your TV, but I already like before we've even gotten started that Mubiel is innovating in this space. So I'm excited to see if this is gonna be, you know, rap, if it's gonna be singing, a little bit of both. So let's listen to Think About and find out. Mm. Oh, so it is gonna be all vertical. Mm. I should have known this would be fun if it's new real. <laughs> I love the groove of this. Mm. <laughs> Ooh. Very dreamy. This is made for TikTok, honestly. Hmm. Yeah, even down to the <laughs> showing you how to do the dance. And yeah, it really does feel like the perfect song for if you're in the car and like grooving on a Friday night or something, that this would be excellent for that. And as much as Moonbill, and as much as Moonbill, and as much as Moonbill absolutely kills a ballad, I think her at my favorite is when she does a playful song like this one. And not just because I tend to listen to music like this more than ballads, but because it just makes my heart happy to see her having fun. And this song just really feels like that. It's just an expression of having fun and I want to spend time with the person that I love. Starting off with Hop In For Now, Anywhere's Fine For Me. It's kind of like, no matter where I go, if I'm with you, I'm happy. And a guide for you, pick everything you want. Like she is your guide who will take you to a fun time in whichever neighborhood in Seoul. But let's continue. Wait a minute, wait a minute, babe. This is making me so happy. Hmm. Don't you want to just go out on a night of fun with Moon Girl, honestly? Hmm. 
You know how there's some songs sometimes that just like make you feel incredibly single? This is a song that makes me feel like incredibly friend single. <laughs> if that makes sense because it's just like the people she's hanging out with and having fun with it's just like oh I want that (laughs) not that I don't have friends but it just looks like fun you know anyways I'm just embarrassing myself at this point This song is so groovy though. It's the perfect pick me up without being too cheesy or anything. This was like the perfect music video to watch when you're like in need of a pick me up. <laughs> I like that's my favorite part. Vroom, 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 vroom. Oh, she's so pretty. Oh, this was so great. I really enjoyed this. I don't know about all of you, but I'm always just so worried about idols and the way that they spend so much of their time practicing and recording. And it seems like they never sleep or they never have time for, you know, relationships or anything like that. So whenever I get to see them have these, what feels like genuine moments of happiness, it just warms my heart so much. And I would be stunned, absolutely shocked if she didn't have an absolute blast making this music video because I just like felt that I felt like she was having so much fun and it just like shone through the screen and I feel like also Moonbyul is just one of the most versatile idols out there where she can just pull off any concept whatsoever like she can do a ballad she can do a fun upbeat pop song like this she can do like an intense rap banger like it honestly feels like there's nothing she can't do in each of those concepts as well it feels like her it doesn't feel like three different people and I just feel like after watching this there's no way if you spent time with Mubiol that you couldn't have fun with her whether you were her friend or her lover and I also feel like for the rest of the day I'm gonna be like oh you it's really the earwormiest of earworms which I'm always a fan of so off to a strong start here and it makes me even more excited now for our next song which is touching and moving now is touching and moving going to keep up the energy here or are we maybe going to slow it down maybe we'll have a rap song or <laughs> I don't think a, I feel like based on the the thumbnail I don't think it's going to be a ballad but if Moonpuyo is anything it is not predictable so I'm excited to see what she brings to the table here with touching and moving for our title track so let's watch the music video Feels kind of like do a leap at you. The grooviness continues. <laughs> oh, I like the record scratch. <laughs> Oh, those horns. Oh, I love that. Oh, I'm obsessed with this instrumental. Oh my goodness. Feels like we just turned the dial up from our last piece of video. Sorry, <laughs> I keep getting distracted. Stop that reaction. No, I will not. Oh, I 
She honestly might drive me crazy at this point because this is like oh, so great. not expect this at all from Mugil. Like from Think About or this. Like I don't know if this is a hot take at all but so far listening to this I feel like this might be one of my favorite instrumentals that I've heard from Mamamoo or any of the solo songs that they have done other than maybe like Egotistic or Starry Night. I've really enjoyed this trend of having like brass in k-pop music a la like standing next to you which feels like old school doo Mamamoo brought into 2024 and that doo-wop sound modernized so i'm so curious if the rest of this album is kind of like a party album you know i just absolutely adore the energy and the vibe that this is bringing so like ugh, absolutely blown away mm, dance break She's bringing the choreo in this too. Excuse me, I saw that. I have to go back. <laughs> oh my gosh. The little baby thrust and the wink. She knows what she's doing. <laughs> Key change. <laughs> I like that she's flexing her choreography chops here too. I like this black leather jacket outfit. It feels very like Matrix chic. <laughs> Oh my gosh. This was so fun. I didn't want that to end. What was she looking at there? Kind of just like looking up at what I imagine is the roof of the subway, but in what feels like hope. I really hope that a song like this can take off and that both of these songs, both Touch and Movement and Think About, can reach larger audiences outside of just Moo Moo. Because like these are two really fantastic, objectively great songs. And I just like love this for her. <laughs> I love to see her having fun and living her best life. Seeing her happiness just like absolutely clears my skin. But this is a type of song that I feel like could go viral because of just how fun and great it is that people will just want to share it with other people. Like I feel like I want to share this song with people who might not necessarily know Moonbyul, but they know K-pop or they like music like this. This kind of like upbeat pop song. But you know, I would honestly like a 17 fan, I might recommend this song to. Or like a Bruno Mars fan maybe. But anyway, I'm just so happy that Moomiel got to make two bangers like the ones that we have listened to and I can't wait to play the absolute crap out of them and I honestly can't wait to listen to the rest of the album as well. So friends, thank you so much for joining me for this video. I would love to hear from all of you which song was your favorite, either Touch and Move In or think about, or was your favorite song from Moonbyul, one of the B-sides on the album? I liked Think About a lot, but I think Touch In and Move In was my favorite because it felt like Think About dialed up to a 10, which I could see why it wouldn't be everybody's vibe and you might prefer Think About instead because it's not as high energy, but 
I'm a high energy type of gal. And I'm not 100% sure if I'll have the chance to listen to the album before I post this video, but if I do, I will definitely let you know my thoughts about it in the comments. Also, definitely stay tuned. I'm going to continue on my mama mood journey. I just keep getting sidetracked by covering too many artists on this channel and there being so many comebacks constantly to keep up with, but I promise more Mama Moo is coming in the future. But until then, I hope you're doing well, staying safe, taking care of yourself, and I hope you have a wonderful rest of your day.